Well, you know, we'll take them however we can get them. Uh, of course, uh, we were, would have liked to have played a little better. We were a little sloppy at times and not really in the moment. You know, there's some critical errors, but, uh, you know, we'll take it. These guys have been working hard since August the 3rd. They've really bought, bought into um, the mindset, and I can appreciate them and the coaches. You know, our coaches do a great job. I ride them hard, and uh, I'm just happy for them. And, uh, this one and then we'll turn the page and uh, get ready for the next one. How big is this victory tonight? Not only in the standings but also to defeat uh, a former coach. Well, you know, Coach Spears uh, is a good friend of mine. And And uh, I just told them to get that back, you know, and, and, and let's play Bama State ball the way that we've been playing uh, all season. And uh, they bought into it, came out in the second half, and was able to get some things done. And uh, if you would talk a little bit about the, uh, the play of uh, your receivers, uh, Nick Andrews uh, in particular, because I understand that uh, uh, he set pretty much uh, a record in his, in his career so far here at Alabama State. Yeah, I think he's uh, he has an all-time uh, touchdown record. You know, Nick is a pro. He's an outstanding uh, athlete, and uh, he's done some really great things for us this season. I think he had 180-some uh, yards today, but uh, he's good. You know, we're happy that we have Nick, and uh, he's been really good for us uh, his entire career and uh, hopefully he can continue it up. And you got a lot of uh, rushing from your quarterback, uh, Greg Jenkins. Yeah, Greg finally found his niche today, you know, and, uh, and some of our zone reads that we run. And, uh, he, you know, he played well for us and did some really good things. And he's a weapon, you know, when he's able to uh, run with the ball. So, uh, you know, we're happy for him. And, uh, you know, he's finally a little healthy now, so hopefully we can keep it going with him. We just see it as another game. Of course, we lost last year, but we came out on top this year. First time in six years, 4-0 in SWAC play. Talk about what that means. Uh, that's huge. 